Hi, Kathy Dam here. I just wanted to give you some tips for taking an assessment successfully in my online course. I think some students think these things are just recommendations, but I consider them more to be requirements um, so that you don't hit any glitches along the way. My first and most important suggestion or requirement is that you do not use Wi-Fi while taking an assessment. Um, Wi-Fi cuts out intermittently and most online programs don't have a problem with that. They will let you kind of uh, start where you last left off and you didn't even realize that Wi-Fi had a little glitch in it. Um, but the exams are not that way. If you have one of those intermittent moments where you've kind of been off and then back on, it will reset the exam. If you try to start the exam again, it'll say you've already taken it. So I do not suggest using Wi-Fi on an assessment because it cannot handle those intermittent um, signals. Um, so you need to make sure you're wired into uh, the wall. My second recommendation is to use Firefox or Safari. Internet Explorer is not supported by Blackboard, which runs our system. Um, so if there's any glitches that come up with um, Blackboard, they're not going to fix it. Um, they will fix Firefox and Safari issues. So I recommend you use one of those two systems to take your test. You'll also want to enable um, pop-ups. Um, just to make sure that if something does pop up that you don't shut the system down by needing to enable it in the middle of a test. You will want to make sure Java is enabled and I provide a link before each test um, to let you test your system to make sure Java is, it, is enabled. And um, lastly, I recommend you don't run anything in the background. Some students like to listen to music or maybe have um, a document open in the background that they can reference. As soon as you click off the page to go into the other, click off the exam to go into the other page, your exam may um, kick you out. And if you have a program open like something to check your mail, if someone sends you mail at that moment, it may kick you out of the exam because it's now... Um, pulled up that other view. So I recommend shutting everything down, making sure there's nothing on in the background, using Safari or Firefox, enabling Java, enabling pop-ups, and making sure you're not using Wi-Fi. Send me any questions if you have them.